Today we're breaking down Nissan code C1130. We're gonna understand why it's an ABS code, but not really an ABS code. Next. This video is sponsored by Nissan, innovation that excites. Visit partsadvantage.nissanusa.com for more information. Today we're breaking down Nissan TSB, NTB 16116, and this is in regards to code C1130. And this is in regards to the ABS system. The description for code C1130 is engine signal is missing. This is typically found in the ABS module. But does it indicate there's a problem with the ABS module? Well, no, it does not. Typically, when C1130 comes up, it indicates the data is missing from the ECM that is required for the ABS module to do a couple different things. When diagnosing for DTC C1130, for the engine signal, the ECM-related DTCs, in other words, the P codes must first be diagnosed, repaired, and the codes erased. On all vehicles, not just Nissan, modules like to tattletale on each other. In other words, modules typically on the CAN high-speed bus need to be talking to each other and the information needs to be complete. Code C1130 is no different. This is typically stored in the ABS module, and it says, hey, that information from the ECM, it's not correct or complete. And typically this happens when there's P codes inside the ECM. In other words, it could be a crankshaft position sensor, a camshaft position sensor, or even a mass airflow sensor. The ABS module and ECM are connected together by the CAN bus on most of these vehicles that are involved in this TSB. They have to be talking to each other so it can carry out things like cruise control, forward emergency braking, and even traction control corrections. If it's not sharing stuff like throttle angle with the ABS module, well, it says, hey, something's wrong and I need to report this. I'm gonna set code C1130. So what does NTB 16116 mean to your overall diagnostic process? Well, it means to perform a complete diagnostic on the vehicle. Don't just scan the ECM or the ABS module. Make sure that you're scanning all of the modules on the vehicle because chances are one module, it's gonna tattletale on another and that will give you a diagnostic path to help correct the problem with the vehicle. I'm Andrew Markell, thank you very much.